Okay, so let's see what we need. Right, Tefnut, what have you got there? Hey, yes, you've got some onions. We need some onions. They need to be chopped up into slices, half slices, and they're going to be done chopped up with which knife? Serrated knife or a straight knife? It's the straight one. Right, otherwise it's going to make you cry. Okay, so, and Lucy, what have you got? Tomatoes. Right, that's what we need to start. A chutney, the onion and the tomatoes. So there we go. Tomatoes, those you can use your serrated knife for. That's perfect. So we've got tomatoes, we've got onions, and each of you has got one of my favorites. Lucy, what have you got? Garlic. Yes, garlic. That we're just going to peel and chop into nice chunky bits. Not fine, just nice chunky bits. And have not you've got chilies. Yes, chilies, green chilies, red chilies. We're going to just slice those in as well. So that'll be good. Yes. Then we've got something else from the garden. Hey, we've got some curry leaves. So we're just going to put a few of those in our chutney as well. And we need some spices. We've got some masala. That's like our curry powder. So it's a mixture of different spices, nice and spicy. This car likes the Durban one. It's nice and hot. And we've got, we're going to, so we're going to use those. And we're going to use some, I wonder if you can remember what these tiny little ones are. Remember the tiny ones we talked about in Devotion? Remember? Teeny, teeny, tiny, look, look, look. What are they? Tiny little ones. Okay. Mustard seeds. Yes, we're going to use a few of those. You can put them into, um, you know, you can grind them with a mortar and pestle. But if you put them into your, your hot pan, the little mustard seeds actually burst and the flavor bursts out with them when it's nice and hot. So that's what I'm going to do with mine. Just put in some nice bursts of that. And then I've got some jira as well. So you can put whatever spices you particularly like. But that's what we're going to use. Don't want to overcomplicate things. I'm not going to use too much masala. Um, yes, so, and then at the very end, you take a nice, fresh coriander, we're going to pick some more, won't we? Yes, we take a nice, fresh coriander, and you just break that up over your nice, hot dal and chutney. Okay, so here are my little taste testers, and they like to check the Flavors just right. That's why they've come in at the chutney part, hey? Yes. So, I put in some sunflower oil. Let that get nice and warm. And pop that back down there. That's where it goes. Put things away as you go. That just helps it make things more efficient. We know what that means, hey? Right. So, we let that get warm. And what are we going to put in first? We're going to put first our onions are nice chopped onions you can see they've been chopped into slices and then the slices um quartered so chopped in half then sliced and in half okay so in they going to go okay nicely in they go let's just give it a little stir okay stir 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 it, hold the pot, hold it by the handle, careful, you don't get too close. There we go. Yes, give it a nice stir. Okay, let it cook. It's on a high heat at the moment. Thank you, Lulu. Mmm, smell of, of onions that are just sizzling in a pot. Mmm, nice. We've got quite a lot in there. We use two onions. Hey, two onions. Now, you don't put the garlic in at this point. Why? Oh, that's right, Lucy. Yes. You don't want to burn it. Because if you put it in now, it's going to burn. And then it gets bitter and then it's not nice. 
Okay, it's fine if you put it in the pot and you let it just boil and simmer and melt into everything. Then you get a lovely garlic taste permeating, going through everything. Okay, but when you do it like this and you fry it, you don't want to fry it too hot and too quickly and it will get bitter. Mm. And too long as well. Oh, what do you think? Okay, you think? Yes, Tekla? Okay, it needs the mustard seeds. All right. Okay. What's best with your spices? Yes, tefna has got it. A spoon. Thank you, my boy. That's because you don't want to pour your spices over. Look what's happening. There's all this lovely steam. Yes, you can see showing it. It's all the steam. And it's going to make your spices get wet because the steam's going to go in them. So you take a little spoon and you... Sprinkle them in. Watch what you're doing. That's right. You sprinkle them in. Ah, there we go. So the mustard seeds are in. The mustard is dry. That's absolutely perfect. That means it won't get wet and then it won't get moldy and yucky. Thank you, Tefnut. Right, you can put your spoon down. You can put those back in there. Thank you. You can see they're in that pot. Can you see all those little black seeds? Yes. So they're going to start popping. And they've got a nice yellow color inside. Mustard yellow. Yes, that's where mustard comes from. So, crushed mustard seeds. But we're going to let those pop and we're going to let the onion brown a bit. Mmm. Okay. Smelling nice. You see, the onion is starting to go nicely brown. It's even browning the bottom of my pot. Don't worry about that. Because when we pop the tomatoes in, and everything's going to start getting mm, 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 all juicy. Can you see that? Look at that. Nice round onions. Hey. Mm. This is the type when it's nice to put it on a hot dog or something. Hey, a horse roll. Mm. There we go. So we've only added the mustard seeds till now. Now what? What are we going to put now? Lucy, do you want to come and help? Come and help me with the tomatoes. Okay. Right. Yes, these ones come. Oh, thank you, my lovely. Ooh, big bowl. Yes, a nice big bowl of tomatoes. We cut it those with cut them with a serrated knife and straight into the bowl so it collects all the juice too. So that can go in now. In it goes, in it goes. Ooh, sizzle, sizzle. Woo! Now. Ooh. That's gonna cook together a little bit. All oh, that lovely tomato and onion. Have a look. Oh, mm. We're going to give that a nice stir. Stir it in. Stir, stir, stir. And now we can add some of the other spices. What were the other ones we were going to add? We were going to add a little bit of jira. And that's also a seed. And... Um, masala, that's our mix, our curry mix, yes. So, come. Tefna, can you identify the jira now? And then Lucy, you can help with the masala. Okay. Right, which one's the jira? Mm. Yes, that one. It's this one. Yes, let's have a look at those little seeds. There we go. Have a look. Okay, those little seeds. I'll put some in my hand so you can see. There we go. Have a look. And we're just going to take a spoon and yes you're using a right hand now well the correct hand for you and in it goes and in it goes yes nice Go. thank you and lulu you can come straight away and do the masala come on that's the yes you know it's the spicy one that's it take it out yes yes there we go, something easier to take from the side. There we go, look. Look, 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 nice colour. Mmm, mm. oh, that's all the spicy spices. Yes, use your hand, your spoon, hold it with your right hand, and in it goes. And in it goes. That's it. Not too much. We don't need too much massage. There we go, put it back. Yes. Okay, and then we just stir it. Stir it nicely. 
Mm. Add a little bit of water if you need to. I'm going to. Just so that it all comes together. Just a little bit. Then in goes our fresh, um, our fresh spices. We've got our garlic that's nicely chunked. Let's have a look. Our nice chunked garlic. Um, and our chilies. We've got some red and green. And our curry leaves, which we've just taken off the stalk. Just and in it all goes. Just like that. Yes. You let it cook a little bit. Do you want to come and give it a stir? Hey? Come give it a stir. Lily, your turn first, my sweet. Here we go. Yes, hold the handle of the pot. And here we go. Oh, those lovely curry leaves and the nice colour and everything in there. It's good, isn't it? Oh, and it's smelling so good. Yes, it is. Thank you, my Lou. Yes, come, we'll hold the pot the other way for you, my boy. Here we go. Take the spoon. Whoops. And around. Oh, mm, smelling good, isn't it? Mm, thank you, Seth. Now, that is coming together so nicely. Mmm, delicious, amazing, wonderful. It's got all those lovely colours of the curry. Mmm, lovely vibrant reds and greens. Let's have a look if you can see it even better like this. Hey, look at that. Nice. Yes. Now, that, actually, oh, it's got that, that nice... Curry is, I can taste it in my throat. Can you taste it in your throat? Mmm, nice. Our chutney is going to go into our dal pot. We're going to mix it all together. And voila, wonderful. Everything, everything. And because I added that little bit of water to my chutney, it's taken all the tasty little bits off the bottom of the pot. Mmm. Here it is, and we're just going to stir that nicely in. Mmm. Oh, how good is that? And served with some fresh coriander.